I've been a lot of different places in the last week, and this showed up at one of them, and I'm going to read it to you. I have no idea what to make of it. <laughs> it's written in a female hand, so that's about all I can tell, but there's no address or name on it. This isn't a question, but a comment, or more accurately, perhaps, a message. I spent this past weekend in an ayahuasca ceremony, which for those of you who don't know, is a South American visionary plant medicine. Some of you may roll your eyes at this, but ayahuasca brings you into direct contact with the archetypal realm of being. Users of this medicine, initiates I should say, refer to ayahuasca as she, because the spirit of the plant is decidedly feminine. An encounter with ayahuasca is an encounter with the great mother of creation, the goddess, the void from which all things come, the feminine counterpart of Logos. Dr. Peterson, you appeared in one of my ayahuasca visions. <laughs> might account for why I've been r rather fatigued lately. <laughs> Dr. Peterson, you appeared in one of my ayahuasca visions, and I asked, asked her, who is Jordan Peterson? What is he doing? Which is something I'd really like to know as well. <laughs> <laughs> and she responded with crystalline clarity. Quote, here, he is here to invoke and initiate the divine masculine principle on earth at this time. <laughs> so I'm up here to thank you deeply and profoundly on behalf of the Great Mother herself, the Goddess, the Divine Feminine Principle, who has been eagerly awaiting the awakening of the Masculine Principle into divinity and service. So, you know, get a little